Chris with Stereo Labs. We're at VRDC and today we're showing off using our Z stereo cameras for mixed reality. So we have sensors right here with two regular CMOS cameras just at a fixed baseline. And just from those images, we're able to scan the environment in real time and at the same time know where the sensor is in relation to that. So what you see this gentleman right here, he's got our sensor mounted to the front of the rift. So he's, uh, we're able to see the geometry in real time and know where it is. So first of all, we don't need the Rift's sensors. We don't have them here because we don't need them. But more importantly, we're able to add virtual elements to the real world and we can do everything like we know how to occlude objects. If a drone is behind something, you don't see it. If it's in front of something, it occludes it. We can cast light on surfaces, we can cast shadows, we can have real and virtual objects collide and, and do the, all that physics. Um, all with just these cameras and our software running on the GPU. Uh, we have two kinds of products. So right now he's wearing the Z Mini, which is meant to be hooked on the front of um, a Rift or a Vive as well. Um, and then you can build a mixed reality application using hardware that you may already own with 110 degrees field of view and with a full dis power of discrete graphics and everything else. Um, we also have another camera, which is already for sale, um, called the Z which is made more for a studio style mixed reality because it goes from one meter to 20 meters away and you can easily have a subject with virtual elements flying around them whether in a video game or an art exhibit or what. Um, you can do all this mixed reality um, with either of our cameras and the one mounted to his face is available for pre-order right now on that website and the other camera is available right now.